Well, it's become clear that they've just lost the support that they've so long relied in in the traditional Labor heartlands. These are electorates that fall in the middle and north of Wales and the UK. Uh, people here, it's colloquially said, are born with Labor blood running through their veins. But it turns out Brexit has turned them. And they're really disappointed with the Labor Party's Brexit policy, which was to have another referendum, which could have effectively cancelled Brexit. And now Labor is being punished for that policy. And these people who used to say they'd rather roll in their graves, they'd rather die than vote Conservative, have now swapped to the Conservative Party. It'll be interesting to see how long they swap for. Is it just this election while Brexit's going on? Or will it be beyond uh, this election and has some real damage been done to the Labour brand in those heartlands? So we need to see what's going on there. But the bottom line is this is a huge punishment for Jeremy Corbyn's policy and also a huge punishment for Jeremy Corbyn himself. Because as much as this is about Brexit, it's also about Jeremy Corbyn, his personality and his style of politics. He is uh, in the Labour Party, but he is a lot further left on the political spectrum than many of the leaders we've had in recent Labour history. He divides people. The team he's brought around him divides people. Their strategy throughout Brexit uh, has been one that's questionable. And now it looks like they're being severely punished for it. And as you heard him there, he's basically said he's resigning. He's not resigning right now, uh, but he certainly won't won't be contesting another election as leader and I would suspect there will be a lot of pressure on him to step down from that role pretty quickly over the next coming days and weeks. He's obviously going to try and hang around to work out who takes over from him and he'll be trying to put someone in with his own sort of socialist worldview. But let's see if the party takes that. They've tried it and it certainly hasn't worked. This is the worst result for Labor uh, since 1935.